You're watching CES Live, powered by Ustream.tv, the most powerful way to stream live video, and by NewTek, makers of the TriCaster family of broadcast and streaming systems. And now, CES Live. Hey guys, welcome back to our continuing coverage of CES. I am John P. And I'm Derek Kessler. It's 2014. What? I know, it's hard to believe, but uh, other things that are hard to believe, we've actually got Scott, the CEO of Polaroid, uh, like here uh, with us. Can you believe it? What are you thinking? Oh, wow, <laughs> that's very special. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to be here. Thanks for having me on your show. It's Thanks for joining you us. Yeah. Cool. You know, Polaroid is one of those brands that's been around for so long. It's like Kleenex. It's yep. like ubiquitous. Mm -hmm. It is ubiquitous. So you guys have had, uh, you've been into a lot of things over a lot of years. We have. This is unlike anything that I've seen in the past. We've yeah, got gadgets. Yeah. We've got some cool gadgets to talk about. The first one, this is called the C cubed. And what they are is they're 35 millimeter in, in, uh, in, in square. And in, what they are is they're high definition, um, action sports cameras. You've got to be kidding what? me. I'm dead serious. They're under $99 is the retail, huh. and they're magnetic. And so there's a magnetic what? mounting system. Instead of using the normal tripod mount, right. we're going to have a whole line of accessories that you just magnetically attach them to. And if you think about the usage model, right, what makes really good action sports content is having multiple perspectives and angles right. shot. Yeah. So you can so take someone, you know, a younger person who's just getting into this, um, they could have multiple different perspectives, whether they're skateboarding, biking, surfing, whatever it is they're doing. And it's super affordable. You can buy more than one. So you're not just stuck with one strapped to your helmet. So you just magnetically stick these things all over the place. Basically that's what you do. How uh, so what kind of different mounting brackets and methods will you have? Honestly, we've got so many different ideas that, that are coming out of the, of the woodwork. Um, but basically, you can have everything from a little tripod looking type mount okay. to um, handlebar, straps. handlebar straps, helmet straps, anything you can mount permanently or fix to a you know, like a surfboard or a wakeboard or something like that. Now, now, just how strong are these magnets going to be? Pretty strong. Okay. Pretty dang strong. And you know, and, and there'll be some reinforcement if you have right. something that's crazy, like it's getting dragged behind a boat or something. <laughs> nice. but, um, and that's what we've got the other professional series for. But yeah, this is uh, these have gotten a lot of interest mm -hmm. because of the price point, because of the form factor. They're just super fun and cool. And uh, and we think it'll help grow the overall kind of videography action sports market. Yeah. Look, I think you said this a minute ago, but I was so like freaking out by the fact that those were actually little cameras. <laughs> These are 1080p or they're, they're 720p. They're 720p. They're 720p, 120 uh, degree uh, viewing angle. So okay. it's kind of wow. a wide Pretty aspect wide. angle. Um, and uh, yeah, ninety-nine dollars. Okay. And what's the battery life going to be like? Battery life, I want to say, is probably around three hours. Okay. Pretty decent. And, and what do they record on to? Um, so they record to an SD card. Yeah. Would where you does unscrew that go? this you'll thing pull, in the you'll back? You'll pop open the back here, okay. right? And that's where your that's where the SD card will go in there. And right. a charging Just pull port. Pull a little mini micro SD out, and you're okay. good to go. And that's you cool. like charge it with a yeah. micro SD or something? Yeah. I mean, a, with uh, a micro USB, USB or something? Yeah. yeah. Cool. Okay. I love the little form factor, and I love that it's got the little Polaroid yeah. kind of. Uh, That's you know, our color spectrum bit of yeah. 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 yeah, That's yeah. who we are. Next product. This is the XS1000i, and what's cool about this product? It also has a proprietary mounting system. So you dis you open up the two little you know wings on here, and then this is a patent pending ball mount mechanism. Wow, nice. Right, and so as opposed to the tripod, doing something different, innovative. So it's just easy to click in. Once you have these installed, you don't want to have to be continually undoing them. Mm -hmm. And of course, those are tripod mounted underneath, so you can use other types of industry standard accessories uh, to do it with. What's great about this camera is it's actually Wi-Fi as well. So this is 1080p full HD Wi-Fi and it streams the Wi-Fi peer-to-peer to your smartphone, whether it's Android or a iOS Apple-based. Um, and using the app, you can actually see what you're recording. Because if anyone's ever used these before, once you mount it to your helmet, you don't see whether it's angled you know, forward, no. downward, upward. And I've used these before where you're going off jumps and skiing, and the thing was pointing at the ground the whole time. You didn't <laughs> yeah, even yeah. see that you, know, no. you cleared something. So, so this actually lets you really easily operate it. Um, because Excellent. of the Wi-Fi. So that's a pretty cool product as well. Nice. And what's the price and availability? This will be, so these will all be available, call it late spring, early summer. Okay. And $99 for the for the cubes. And then this guy is going to be probably around, uh, around $149, $179, somewhere in that range. Gotcha. All right. Yep. 
the other cool product we have at CES is this guy. And this is, this is the Polaroid. Please tell me that little <laughs> instant pictures pop out of this yes, thing. Yes, they do. This is, this is so awesome. This is conjuring some intense nostalgia <laughs> so, right now. So this is, this is basically an instant digital camera called the Z2300. And it prints wallet size photographs um, right out of that side exit slot. You can take 10 megapixel pictures and then print in the moment. So not only are you getting the digital copy, which is saving to an SD card, you can print wallet size moments. You know, we like oh. to call ourselves that Polaroid was the original social network because right. you took a picture and you shared it in the moment. And our brand has always stood for innovation and sharing really at the core as well as instant. And so this allows and brings all that to life. Now there is a product that I don't have here to show you because I only have like three samples in the entire world, and yeah. they're all in my in booth. The booth. <laughs> um, and that is called the Socialmatic camera. Okay. So imagine the, pr the printing capability that this camera has, embedding that into a device that has a 4.5 inch touchscreen, it has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, so you can instantly share to social networks, and it has GPS for geotagging. So now you're getting that whole kind of you know, Polaroid experience, being able to print it, and also being able to instantly share it wirelessly. So, nice. awesome. pretty cool product. By the way, question uh, from Distant Soil. Is there a pre-order page? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to hear that. That's, that's good to hear. That's Polar a good sign. Keep an eye on Polaroid.com. That's all I have to say. <laughs> now, now, how does this print? I mean, it doesn't have an yeah. inkjet cartridge. How does it work? So, what it is, is this uses a technology that was born inside of Polaroid called Zinc. It stands for zero ink. Oh. Okay. And so what happens is you buy a pack, a 10 pack of, of media, and with that 10 pack of media, usually come in 30 packs or 60 packs. Basically, it's got this paper, and in the paper there is no ink. Or that's what's so cool about it. Is it's basically a dye crystal technology. Take this guy out here. And so in this paper is embedded a billion dye crystals. Cyan, yellow, and magenta. No way. And, then and you, you pop them? What? Basically <laughs> using a heat, thermal heating process, based on how much heat you're hitting on the back of the media, brings forth the proper color because you're melting the crystals. That is crazy. So more heat makes certain colors, less heat makes other colors. <laughs> and, uh, and it's super cool. So this is from Zinc Imaging, technology born inside a Polaroid. Wow. And this is the technology that's in the Z2300 and in the new Socialmatic camera we just announced. And a question uh, from Brandon, how much do the consumables cost, or how much? You know, the consumables are actually really affordable on this. You know, the, the an analog film always sold for about a buck a shot. Right. A 10 pack of film was 10 bucks. Um, in this case, you can get a 30 pack of media for probably about $14.99. So it's half the price of what the normal analog film costs. So nice. much, much more affordable. Yeah. Well, I like the fact that you can take the picture and you still have the digital version and yeah. you get the printed yeah. version as well. And you get that printed version instantly. You don't have to go down to the corner market or to your, you your house to print it out. Yeah. Well, let me, so let me get this right. If I, if I wanted to take like 10 different pictures and then yeah. figure out which one I wanted, then I'd just print that one. You like, can. I do it first, I can take you all review. my pictures. Then I can print one, what I want to exactly. print. Exactly. That's what's nice is the reviewing paradigm. The paradigm With instant photography, normally you took the shot in analog and you get what you get. With yeah. this, how did it turn out? You yeah. can actually review it and say, I want that photo and I want to print five. There's one thing that I'm a little disappointed in with this whole new fangled, you know, digital laser bubble printy <laughs> thing. I can't shake it and make it work faster, hey, you know? You can always shake it. Oh, okay. I, right, I'm okay it. with that. You know, feel free to shake it like a Polaroid picture. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> we're, not, we're not against it. We're not against that at all. <laughs> nice, nice. All right. Well, any other big, like, groundbreaking news we should cover before we uh, wrap it up? You know what else is cool? So we have a 4K 50-inch LED TV that we're retailing for 9.99. I heard wow. about that. So we're breaking the price point barrier on that. On that. Oh, you that's. Know? It's pretty shocking. A lot of people don't realize. Edwin, 50 inch. 50 inch LED TV. 4K. 4K Ultra HD. Three HDMI ports. 1.4 HDMI for 9.99. Wow. When? Starting in March. Yep. In March. So, Where? You know what? Will people be able to I buy it like on Amazon? Or? Am yeah, look on the general websites, a lot of the regional carriers, yeah. We, we don't have the, you know, the full release, but yeah, keep an eye on Polaroid course. and you can find it from there. Okay, cool. All Definitely. Right. Good stuff. Yeah. All right, guys, we'll definitely right. let you know as soon as, uh, as soon as that 4K TV is out, as well as all of these little bad boys right here. So you got to stay tuned to Geek Beat and all the Mobile Nation sites. Absolutely. We're going to keep you up to date. And we're going to keep you up to date with even more coverage right here, live from CES 2014. I'm John B. And I'm Derek Kessler. Out of here.